lot of stuff in here. Unlike animal uh, <laughs> body preparations, histology, at least this stuff is a little bit more user friendly. So it's a spider food scope. Okay. Now, I have too much light in here. Everyone's bleached out. And let's see, let's do this, this condenser. This is a faint slide right here. It is not going to stay in that dark, but at least it's not that light. These are nice slides. Okay, so this is the tip of a fairly common house plant. Once again, coleus. I don't know why, dude. Well, coleus, you don't even grow indoors. You can't. It's nice nicer to grow them outdoors in a shady spot. I got a lot of welding and metal fabrication to do before I can have it dark again. Six golden retrievers will destroy anything that's not made out of steel or concrete. You would not believe that this stuff dug up and destroyed. I mean, literally underground conduit housing. And they destroyed it. Okay. I used to have nice things. Okay, so this is a coleus stem tip. This is actually a cross section of a coleus leaf, and those are all trichomes. Big multicellular trichomes that are sticking out, which kind of makes what uh, the textbook says a lie or inaccurate information. Oh, it's actually pretty good. So we have an instance of textbook orthodoxy meaning the real world. This is a leaf surface, and these are little hair-like structures that stick up above a leaf. Now, your electronic uh, textbook went to great lengths to talk about glabrousness versus pubescence and all that. Um, if you were to look at these on a leaf, you'd notice that some leaves of some house plants, none of outdoor plants, stuff like sage and whatnot, have a hairy appearance or a scaly appearance. Technically, these are sort of multicellular trichomes, just projections from the epidermal layer for protection against animals eating them, protection against water loss, ultraviolet radiation, who knows what. So there's one that's made of at least one, two, three, four, five cells. I thought they were just extensions of cell cytoplasm. Once again, real world, these textbook, textbook, real world, all play nice. Okay, but I'm really looking for a uh, leaf shoot here, and I'm having a tricky time locating. Oh, come on, man. There we go. So now we got stem. Uh oh, it's upside down. I hate upside down slides. Okay, well, I'm going to flip this the other way so it's the way I actually drew it on the board. Student dead, you're already 20 something. Your great grandmother's nagging you about me, 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 